Hi, Kirsten and Christy. It is Monday the 17th. Happy St. Patty's Day. Um, although today is not so springish as most Happy St. Patty's Days are. It's snow today, and this is ridiculous. I don't know why there has been so much snow this, I almost said this summer, oh, this past winter, but this is crazy. It is almost spring. It should not be snowing a couple days before spring, but alas, it has. So unfortunately we had another snow day so not only did it just snow but like we literally had a snow day at school and this is driving me crazy they've already extended the marking period but now that extension was pretty much useless because there's it's still not enough time to make up everything that we are basically going to still miss um, besides that this morning was actually pretty relaxing until I discovered a not so itchy friend on my head again. Yeah, that's right. I found another lice today and I don't know oh I just spit I don't know how or where it has come from, but luckily I did the entire treatment and I only found one louse. That's that's the singular form, right? I think yeah, louse. And three eggs. So I'm hoping that well I'm not hoping, I'm just yeah, well, I'm hoping that was it, but I'm also hoping that this this isn't new. I don't know what I'm hoping anymore. I just uh, I'm like I'm so done. I like, <laughs> words cannot describe the feeling of just your heart ripping out of your body, your heart just stopping, just exploding just something's going on and when you see that it was just so disappointing but treated again my parents want me to stop going to the nursery so I think I might I think I'm gonna put in my two weeks notice I'm gonna send my boss that sounds weird to say boss because it's at a church but yes I have to send my boss an email tomorrow and I think I'll officially kind of quit the church that sounds weird, <laughs> but quit the nursery at the church. Um, I don't know. I feel like because it's been so long, there has to be somewhere else that I'm getting this, and maybe there is a kid at the church that has it. I don't know. Or maybe there's kids that are in the nursery during the week when I'm not there that somehow they fall off and I catch them. I mean, I'm a pretty active person when it comes to handling the kids at the nursery so I'm rolling around and running around and doing whatever so who knows so I figured if I eliminate one possibility then maybe either that is where I'm getting it or I'm getting it somewhere else but at least I can figure it out because I'm one step closer so uh, that kind of ruined my day so much for having a nice snow day um, so yeah, I had to clean all my bedspread and spray everything down. It takes a lot out of you. Um, but yeah, besides that, I'm still reading the archive, Christy. I know you asked me that a week ago or so, but I'm, I'm still at the same spot where I last told you. Um, I wanted to read today, but my day was occupied. I... Oh, also, because I didn't film last week, I didn't get to tell you that Earl and my anniversary was on the 8th, so we had a really, really nice day. Um, I don't remember if I told you guys about the scooters, but we bought these awesome scooters, and I, I'm really going to have to do like a follow me along uh, type of vlog so you guys can see these scooters in action because they're so cool. They're so cool. Or maybe only Earl and I think they're cool, but we get awesome looks when we ride them around places. They're like, ooh, where'd you get that? Or like Toys R Us. <laughs> oh, my um, my best friend at at well, Chrissy, you already know my, you're my best friend, but my best friend at school, she's the the teacher across the hall. She makes fun of me all the time for these scooters. She's like, yeah, just scoot off into the sunset, girl, and I'm like, you know it. <laughs> but these scooters are awesome. Um, but yeah, so we on our anniversary we went to the movies and then we scooted. Um, he bought me these earrings that are, they're kind of these Celtic design, 
um, triangles. They're really, really pretty. I wish I could do these fancy zooms and whatnot, but I can't. So that's that. Um, he also bought me a candle. Um, this one's called the Ring Candle. He wanted to get me one of the diamond candles, but they were all sold out. But apparently their stock went super out of stock and super low because of Christmas and they hadn't refilled except for like three or four flavors that he knew I wouldn't want. So he got me fresh linen. It smells good. Um, I already dug the can, I mean the ring out, which is also very pretty. Um, it's kind of, it's kind of my style. And again, I'm showing you this and you can't see it, but it's my style. It's just too big because my fingers are so small. So it doesn't, kind of looks proportionally wise not the greatest on my hand but it's still really pretty so I wear it from time to time since I've gotten it um but that's pretty much it uh, the archive is really all I've been reading and reading very slowly even though it's such a good book and it's so short so I don't know I, don't know, I just haven't had time to read it there's so much going on at school that I have to get done the stress level is which is another reason why I should quit the church because it's just it's just too much I, I lose almost all of my Sunday and here comes my mom hi mom hi. want to say hi to Christy and Kirsten hi Christy who's Kirsten? 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 Uh, girl we met at school oh uh, hi so my mom's awesome <laughs> she helped she even though I you would think at least Christy from what you know her you would think she would freak out the most with this situation but she's a rock she she knows how to handle this so props to her um so yeah I think I'll end it here today I don't have much to report on hopefully next time I see you we'll, we'll report is it the end is it the end of the month already next week I think so yeah so I'll report on our book of the month um Oh, I guess that was a lie then, what I told you, because I did read The Invisible Man. I, re I took it to school, and I read it um, one day when I actually did have my planning period, and I, for once I didn't have anything to plan. I don't know how that works out. Whenever my planning is taken away by some sort of meeting or whatnot, I have so much to do, but <laughs> the one time I didn't have anything to do when I actually had my planning, I'm glad I brought my book because I got a lot of it done. So yeah, that actually is done. So, I guess I'll report that next week, or so, or something, or let me know. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I'm rambling now. I hope you guys have a great week. I hope you had a great weekend. Hopefully the snow didn't affect you too much, Christy. I hope you're feeling better. Kirsten, keep up the good work. I know you're doing great in Texas. And yeah, see you guys later. Bye.